All right, everybody, we are back and we are about to have some fun. I am doing what everybody on this planet is asking for. I've had people in my DMs, people commenting on Twitter. Reds Daily, all we want is a Kevin Newman breakdown. He was everybody's favorite Red last year. Kevin Newman, let's get into it. You're welcome. Here's our guy. All right, as you can see, our boy Kevin Newman, 30 years old. Hit 253 last year, 311 on base percentage, 78 WRCS, WRC plus. Not great, right? But let's dive into it and let's see, really, was he as bad as everybody made him out to be? I was interested to do this. I really was just interested to do this because Kevin Newman got so much hate last year. So let's dive into it and let's see what we find out. We're going to start out going month by month because we know what his numbers were throughout the year we know what his numbers were against left-handed pitching throughout the year but I want to dive in month by month and kind of see did he just have one good month that skewed the numbers did he have a couple good months let's just kind of see how it all played out so all right we're gonna start with April we're gonna go April 1st to April 30th what did our boy Kevin Newman do I am already off to a bad start because I want to be on the advanced stats. Get back up to the advanced stats. All right. April 1st to April 30th. Kevin Newman in April. What did he do? He had a 606 OPS. Not great, folks. Not, not, not great. So not a good start for our boy Newman. But again, this is overall not against left-handed pitching, which is where he did the most of his damage. All right. We're, we're going to move on to May. In May, let's see what our boy Kevin Newman did. Kevin Newman from May 1st to May 31st, 804 OPS. What a month in May. Kevin Newman, we're back. Reds fans are loving you. Not really, but listen, I, I was a Kevin Newman stand. He played all right last year for what they needed him, needed him to do. And May, he had a pretty solid month. All right, let's get out of May and let's hop into June. And let's see what Mr. Newman did in June. June 1st to June 30th. Kevin Newman, 673 OPS plus or OPS, not great again. But again, this is overall stats. It's not that important. He didn't play a ton against right-handed pitching in this span. Probably too much. Again, I, I stick up for David Bell, but Newman should not have been getting a lot of at bats against right-handed pitching. But all right, from here. He didn't play much on from July on. He had the injury, and a lot of the young guys were called up. Let's see what he did July through the rest of the year. That's where it got really bad. 557 OPS. It just was not good the rest of the year. Again, he was dealing with injuries, didn't play much of the rest of the year, so not great. Again, we'll recap that. 606 OPS plus in April, 804 OPS. Um, I keep saying OPS plus. It's just OPS. 804 OPS in May. 673 in June, 557 in July on. But here's where we get into it. We are going to go to the little thing called we call splits. And we're going to see how he did against left-handed pitching because that's where Kevin Newman got a lot of his playing time. And the people on X.com were furious that Nick Senzel was in the lineup and Kevin Newman was in the lineup, but they did a lot of their damage against left-handed pitching. So again, I wanted to dive in and see, did he just do a lot of his damage during the little span or did he actually, was he actually pretty consistent against left-handed pitching? So we're going to hit the little splits tool. We're going to see what fan griff fan graphs spits out to us. We don't care about, I'll tell you one thing. We really don't care about um, April 1st, 2002. So we're going to go 23. And we're going to go 430, 2023. Bam. Here we go. I'm going to hit first left-handed pitching. I'm going to hit advanced. All right. What did Mr. Newman do in April against left-handed pitching? He had a 792 OPS. Pretty solid. He had 29 plate appearances. Pretty solid. 
pretty solid. He's off to a strong start. Everybody's loving Kevin Newman. Remember that home run he hit earlier in the season? People were loving him. Man, did it take a turn. All right, let's get to May. May, what do we have? 1.003 OPS against lefties with 27 plate appearance. Kevin Newman is crushing lefties. It doesn't matter if you throw Kershaw up there. He's going to crush him. Kevin Newman is destroying the ball against left-handed pitching in May. Give this guy an MVP if he was playing against lefties every day. All right, let's see if he keeps it up in June because I think at this point, people are already hating Kevin Newman, and he is destroying left-handed pitching. But let's let's go on. Let's see what happens in June. June, we got a 993 OPS. Kevin Newman continues to destroy left-handed pitching. He continues to rake against left-handed pitching. Again, definitely into June, people were – so over Kevin Newman, where everybody's calling for Ellie to be called up. Ellie got called up in early June, which, again, I think Ellie should have been called up. I was calling for Ellie to be called up. But Kevin Newman just got some crazy hate. He he was not that bad, and he was really good against left-handed pitching. But once again in June, all right, and let's see how he did the rest of the year. Again, he did not play that much starting in July, and that's when the numbers fell way off. 28 plate appearances against lefties. 472 OPS. So it went way downhill. But again, I can you can count that on the young guys coming up and he barely played the rest of the year due to injury. So just to recap this video, Kevin Newman, I wish you the best of luck this year. You got a lot of unnecessary hate from Reds fans. You came in, you played against lefties. You probably played too much against righties, but that's not your fault. David Bell puts you in the lineup. You go out there and give it your best shot. But against lefties, you did your job. You raked. And I won some money off you last year, Kevin. Against lefties, play those play those um, total bases bets, Kevin Newman. You did you did well. Us as Reds fans, I think we, some of us would like to apologize. You were not as bad as X.com made you out to be. You crushed left-handed pitching. I wish you nothing but the best this year, Kevin. And that's it for the Kevin Newman recap. Like, subscribe if you made it this far. Can't wait to do more breakdowns. We'll see you guys later.